Stay away from Elizabeth. Or what? Oh, really lucky. You have no jurisdiction at Shady Brook. You're just a small town police officer who drinks too much and refuses to give up a teenage infatuation when Elizabeth has clearly moved on. I'll do whatever it takes to protect Elizabeth and her children from you. Ah, there's the fantasy, isn't it? Lucky the great protector of this sweet little family. Never mind that Elizabeth is a little tramp who will never love you as much as you love her. That's not true. I, I do love her. him. Look at her. What do you and Nicholas see in her? And who would imagine that she, <laughs> of all people, would be pregnant with the Cassidyne heir? You should be relieved, Lucky. Now, Nicholas has released you from any obligation to Elizabeth. You don't need to listen to her lies anymore. Now, that should be liberating in itself. Now, Elizabeth is pregnant with Nicholas's child. That makes her a Cassadine responsibility. This baby could very well be mine, Helena. Well, I suppose. But imagine, Nicholas and Elizabeth rutting like animals all over Windermere for many months. I don't think the odds are in your favor. Stop it! You do not need to paint yourself as a victim. Get anymore. out! Your love that you two have shared has been dead for a very long time, at least as far as Elizabeth is concerned. It's not true. I suspect that it's dead for you too, Lucky. You just don't know how to admit it. So you obliterate the whole situation with drugs and alcohol, anything to avoid the truth. Now you're sick and tired of Elizabeth's lies and promiscuity. Well, in your heart, if you admit it, it's been over for Elizabeth for a very long time. And fortunately, when we prove this child is a Cassidyne, you'll be out of the picture. I'm going to protect Elizabeth, whether this baby is mine or not. Protect her all you want, but it won't change the pattern. Elizabeth will whore herself out. Get out! <laughs> she'll whore herself out to the next Mr. Wonderful, and then she'll come back to you. Now, it may be your obligation to take her back. But my only concern is the child. So take good care, Elizabeth. She's gone. Come here, she's gone. whatever I can to make sure Helena doesn't come near you again. I'm sorry. No one would blame you for walking away. Helena has her, her own agenda. She's just trying to manipulate both of us. But a lot of what she said was true. You have no obligation to me or to this baby. No matter whose it turns out to be. Maxie and me 
having sex in our marriage bed, you, remember? You were addicted to pills. I don't really have an excuse. Well, you're not an addict, but the pattern is pretty obvious, Elizabeth. You, you self-sabotage. You get close to what you say you want, and then you mess it up. And I don't know why. But something is very wrong, and you need to face it. And you need to deal with it. I want you to get better. I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to turn my back on you now. We're part of each other's lives. We always will be. Does this mean you forgive me? When I found out about you and Nicholas, all I could feel was, was pain. The drinking took the edge off. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'll always have to deal with the urge to blot everything out with drugs and alcohol. You have every right to be angry. We've both made some really, really horrible mistakes. And Elizabeth, we, we don't know what the future holds. But that's okay. That, that, that's okay. Everything is gonna be fine. Cam and Jake are still my boys. We're still a family. That's what I want more than anything. another time. I don't want to make you upset. Helena was here. I was afraid of that. In fact, she was here twice. Lucky you had to run her off. Well, I'll make sure that she doesn't bother you again. She's already obsessed with this baby, Nicholas. How does she even know? I, I, I have no idea. And if this baby is yours? What does it mean for all of us? If it is, then we'll welcome it with love. It's not the baby's fault how things came to be, and I can't be sorry for it. I can. Well, Elizabeth, I regret all the lies that I told. And I wish that I would have told Lucky the truth from the beginning. But I'm still in love with you. Um, I'll probably just try to resend it again. 